Would you inject something into your skin just for the sake of beauty? Well, I'm going to say yes and no. So normally I'm a no person. Like I don't do Botox. I don't do fillers. I'm not saying never. I'm just saying it's not really my thing. But I have been really interested in doing micro needling. And today I'm doing something at home that's really similar to micro needling, but a heck of a lot cheaper and hopefully with just as good results. So if you're new here, I'm Phaedra and this channel is all things Phaedra where I cover all things because you know, I, I like all things and I try and bring you my genuine honest take as if you were sitting right here with me and I'm having a conversation with you. And that may be about the latest movie I saw, the latest car I drove, or in this case, the latest beauty treatment I'm trying. So I encourage you to subscribe and then just come back and watch the videos that appeal to you. So today, if you're here though, this probably appeals to you. This is a skincare system called Cure, spelled Q-U-R-E. Cure reached out to me and said, can we send you our micro what do they call it? Micro infusion three month bundle. Can we send this to you? And like I do with all of these types of requests, I Google it and I check it out. I'm like, okay, does this really work? Or is this really like the next big thing? Um, the neck or the, the Instagram ad, the Facebook ad, the thing that you're like, no, this is the thing that's really going to work. And I found some pretty good information out there, and I don't just mean from their website. I went to the most reliable place on the internet, and that is Reddit. I'm joking, of course. What I did find is that there are a couple of these microinfusion systems out there, and one that shall remain nameless was widely said to be garbage. But this one, Cure, actually had some really good um, general like feedback and results information out there. But there was a lot of questions like, well, does it really work? I had trouble applying it. And so I thought, all right, let me step in. Let me try this. Let me help you figure out how to use it and talk about if it really works. So let me show you what you get in the kit. So this is the kit, the Handle With Care Beauty Clinic inside, and I'm a sucker for packaging. I really like the look, the quality of this packaging. The future of skincare is in your hands, literally. That's what it says right there. Okay, so what do you get with the microinfusion system? So it says it's for three months, and three months is assuming that you use the treatments every two weeks. They say you can do it every two to four, but generally two, every two weeks is what's gonna get you the best results. So the first thing we get is a hair tie, something to pull our hair back and out of our face. And then this right here is the micro infusion system. There is a really helpful QR code here that if you're like, I'm not sure exactly what to do, scan that and it'll walk you through everything. But hopefully after this video, you won't feel that way at all. This is what, hold on, hold on. This is what the micro infusion device looks like. So what you've got on top, I'm not gonna take the top off yet. Those are 24 karat gold micro needles on the top. And then we've got a glass vial here. It's empty at the moment because what we're going to put inside are one of the serums that they sent me. So they sent me three samples of the rejuvenation serum. And this is one, I guess it's been on TikTok a lot. This is designed for discoloration, fading dark spots, and helping evening skin tone. So if you are younger, this is going to be the one that you would probably use. And this one is good also if you've got acne and acne scars and you're trying to um, raise those scars a little bit. For those of us that might be a wee bit older or with some different skin issues, we've got the Hydro Soothing Serum. And this one is designed to reduce the look of lines and wrinkles, soothe redness, and boost hydration. Now, I want you to know when it comes to anti-aging stuff, nobody can fix this. I mean, surgically, yes, you can. But what they can do is they can reduce the appearance of aging, and that's really what we're here for. Also in the package, you have replacement needles, five replacement needles, because every time you do a treatment, for sterility's sake, you want to use a new needle head. Now I'm gonna show you how we're gonna put this together and then we're gonna, we're gonna micro needle or micro infuse my face. Okay, let's talk about the prep work. So you wanna make sure that your face is clean, your skin is clean, 
that you don't have any makeup on. I mean, I might have a little on my eyes, but I don't have any makeup on my face. And I'm gonna awkwardly do this to pull my hair back. That's not too bad. Okay, there we go. And you also wanna make sure that you're not doing anything with like um, exfoliators or retinols or anything like for probably a day or two before you do this. You, you don't want your skin to be too sensitive. Okay, oh, I kind of like this look. You also want to avoid the sun, so don't th do this like if you're just back from the beach and you've got a sunburn or anything like that. And also if you have like major breakouts on your face, you might want to wait. Now if you have a few blemishes or something, it's okay. You're just going to want to avoid those areas as we're using this, all right? Uh, look, I have to admit, I got this in probably a week and a half ago, maybe two weeks ago. I've been, I've been nervous. I'm nervous to put needles in my skin. So we're going to do this together. Okay, I have my vial out. I'm going to do half rejuvenating and half hydro soothing. All right, now comes the important part. Now, we want to make sure that the serum gets down into the needles. And this is a complaint I heard about online quite a bit, is that the serum doesn't quite make it out. So what you want to do is you want to make sure you turn it upside down for, I don't know, about a minute or two. Okay, so that has been a few minutes, and I think we're ready to begin. And you might be having all the questions that I have, like, is it going to hurt? How do I apply it? Can I do it under my eyes? Can I do it under my neck? I'm going to talk you through all that while we try this together. First, let's take a look at these needles. You can see they're very short needles, and it's supposed to be thinner than a human hair. So it's not going terribly deep, but we're going we're gonna to try it. And you want to start by working from the outside in at the very top of your forehead. And you want to do a 50% overlap. So you're just going to basically continually stab your skin. I'm not feeling much of the serum coming out. It's making my nose tingle. Now the serum's coming out. Okay. It took a little while. So I'm going to make sure every spot has gotten it. Yeah, okay, now I've got some serum coming out. So I'm going to work my way across my forehead, down the bridge of my nose, onto my cheeks, my neck, my chin. And again, I'm just doing overlapping circles here on my skin. I'm going to do about 50% overlap. Let's talk about what this actually is, in case you're not familiar with microneedling and why you would even do this in the first place. So microneedling which is basically what this is. You're just not using a roller and you're actually injecting serum at the same time. It's designed to penetrate the top layer of your skin and basically cause micro injuries to your skin. And that may sound like a bad thing, but it's actually a good thing. If you think about when you work out at the gym and you're trying to build muscle, you're actually injuring your muscle, which is stimulating the muscle fibers to lengthen and to grow. So similarly, what we're doing is we are causing injury to the face to stimulate the collagen. And the collagen is what gives us stronger connective tissue on the face and keeps us from sagging. Now your question might be, does it hurt? Does it hurt? It definitely feels like very small needles going into your skin and it makes me want to sneeze. Now they typically recommend you do this at night. I think because it'll make your face red and that way you don't have to worry about going out in the sun and not having makeup on. All right, what do you guys think? You can really obviously see that it has made my skin red, which is good, right? Because you want it to actually be doing something. You want it to sort of like not irritate your skin, but you know, you're doing these micro injuries to help. All right, next up, we're going to do the cheeks, the cheeks. And while I'm doing the cheeks, oh, that kind of hurts. I'm going to talk about why you would want to do micro injection versus micro needling. So with micro injection, you're actually using a serum. So you're not just penetrating the skin layer. You're actually inserting a serum that can help your skin below the surface level. And because you're 
lifting it up and down like this instead of rolling back and forth with a microneedle roller, there's less risk of actually damaging your skin. And then finally, if you're doing this at home, like I am, a lot of people don't realize that there's risk of infection. You are basically penetrating the surface of your skin. If, if you're using a microneedle roller over and over again, it's not enough to just clean it with soap and water. Like you have to use alcohol and pretty much sterilize that thing every single time. So with this system, you're actually using a new needle tip for every application. Okay, I've done a first pass on my face and hopefully you can tell it's pretty red. Um, it feels pretty irritated, um, not in a bad way, maybe like if I got a sunburn or, or like you just had an aggressive facial, that's how it feels. But if you look, I've only used about half of the serum. So this is really the tricky part. When you are applying it, you're gonna have to stop several times and hold it upside down or even give it a tap on the table. They do recommend going over your face two to three times. So I'm gonna do that and see if I can get um, a little bit more of this serum to release into my skin. So when you're all done, what you wanna do is you wanna cap this back up. You will not be reusing these needles and that keeps it safe, can put that in the garbage, and then I've got all this serum left. So I don't know what I did the second time around, but the serum came out so much better, so much easier. I saw some air bubbles pop up and I had absolutely no problem at all. The serum came out just fine. But what they want you to do is with the remaining serum, you can just take it out of the bottle and just, oh, it smells really good, and just slather it all over your skin. I'm gonna do it again in two weeks and give you a better update. Through the magic of video, it's only been a few seconds for you, but it has been three weeks for me since I, I did my last treatment. And I'm gonna see if I can remember exactly how to do this. And they say it takes five minutes. Let's see if I can do it in five minutes. All right, I just completed two treatments everywhere except my neck. I still have a pretty fair amount of serum left over. So I may stamp a couple key places on my face and then I'm just gonna finish rubbing the serum in and then I'll be back in two weeks. Well, today is an exciting day because today is results day. I have spent, mm, probably eight weeks, almost two months using this Cure Micro Infusion three month bundle. Okay, so first of all, let's talk about the usage. So you're supposed to use these needles and this treatment every two weeks. I've used it three times in an eight week period. So probably about every three weeks is, is what I used. And I thought that worked really well for me. That's kind of a way to help you stretch your skincare dollars if you don't wanna do the recommended every two weeks. I think you can do it as consistently as you want, but for me, doing it every three weeks seems to be really helping. And I will say after the first time I used this, I definitely saw results. After the second time I saw results and the third time, I am continuing to see results with the micro infusion system. How do I judge that? Well, there are two ways. The first one is, let's get up close and personal. Now this is a different camera, slightly different, but this is best for me to show you an up close version of what's going on on my face. So I do wanna say that I am coming up on a birthday. I'm 53 let you guess how old I'll be on my next birthday. But this is what my skin looks like. I still have lines, I still have sagging, I still have wrinkles, but I think overall the texture of my face looks really good. Like I am really happy with the overall look of, of my face. And I do wanna point out that I do not have any makeup on other than my eyes and my lips, but on my face, 
This is just my natural skin, just from using moisturizers. So um, don't be fooled thinking I've got some foundation on or concealer. There is nothing here. This is just my skin. The biggest indicator of how well that this skincare has worked for me, two things. I saw my sister maybe about two weeks ago and just out of the blue, she said, what are you doing? Now she's three years older than me. And we talk about this kind of stuff all the time, but um, I'm a little bit more into the beauty regimens than she is. And she said, what are you doing to your skin? And I said, well, you know, I've got some retinol. She goes, no, it's not that. There's just something, your face just has kind of a glow about it. And I said, as a matter of fact, and I showed her the microinfusion system. She's like, okay, I wanna get that. The other thing is that I was just at an event last week and there was a guy there, This no, this was not a pickup situation. And he s said, when I revealed my age, that he thought I was in my mid to late forties. And he said, and I'm usually pretty good about ages. So I consider five to 10 years younger than I actually am to be a win. So I thought overall that this is a really solid system. I could see that it was actually doing something to my skin and I can see results. But just to make this fair and balanced, my only complaint, my only issue with the Cure skincare um, well, two things actually, and I, I've kind of made that known as, as we've gone. So there are a lot of complaints online about the serum not coming out of this piece very readily. And I experienced the same thing. And I will say that for me, the way to make it work is to have it sit upside down for at least, they say a few minutes, I say at least 10 minutes. And then you wanna kind of tilt it back and forth because you wanna let the air bubbles escape because I think it's those air bubbles that prevent the serum from coming through. I even found myself giving it flicks like you might do with a needle to get rid of any uh, bubbles. And the third time that I used it, I had none of those issues at all from the very first time I started putting the serum on. My only other issue is that they do give you a lot of serum. Like even going over my face two or three times, I had a lot of serum left over. And so I do think that, uh, I'll have to look at how they sell it on their website, but I do think you can make this serum stretch out a little bit longer. I know they don't want you to do that, but that's a good way to make your skincare dollars stretch. So I test a lot of different types of skincare and I'm always looking for something that is non-invasive, meaning I don't want any injectables, I don't want any surgery, something that's just gonna help my skin look more like its natural best. I am super, super thrilled with this Cure Micro Infusion System. And if you wanna try it, I'm gonna put a link down below. Now that's my affiliate link, but I only want you to try it out if you really think it's something that's gonna work for you. And I'm sharing my honest and true perspective. No money changed hands. All they did was provide me free product. And this is my honest and true opinion. Cure Skin Care. I have another one of their products that I'm gonna to put to the test. So, if you're interested in that, first of all, give this video a like and be sure to hit the subscribe button because you and me, we're gonna keep fighting this aging thing as much as possible. All right, guys, thanks, and I will see you next time.